What's happening guys? Today's topic, Windows Live Family Safety. And today, I'm gonna show you how to set up web filters inside of it. So, let's go check it out. Now that we have web filtering set up for our Windows Live Family Safety, I'll show you how to set up web filtering lists. Let's say for instance, we currently have the settings set for allow list only. Then, you'll wanna go down to filtering lists. And this is where you'll simply allow websites Otherwise, the account won't be able to view any websites. So let's add Cartoon Network. Then we'll just simply hit Allow. Make sure we save. And there you go, Cartoon Network has been added to the Allow list. So anything within the domain of cartoonnetwork.com, the account will be able to view. I can simply click on Remove to remove that from the list. And if I'm managing multiple accounts, I can decide if it's for everybody it'll be blocked or allowed, or if it'll be just for the one account that I'm under right now. So when it says, for this person only, we're looking at the kids account that I have set up. Now, let's take a look at another website. How about CNN? We'll just put this website on the block website. Then hit save. And here on the right, you can see that this website's been blocked. Another thing I can do inside of the web filtering list is I can use a list from another account or I can use this list to another account. If you'd like to remain really strict on your allow list, simply set it to whatever website you'd like. One thing to keep in mind is the requests because here on the request page you will see requests to websites the account would like to go to. Then once you see that request, you can simply add it to the web filtering list. And there you go, it's a pretty basic feature, but allows for the utmost amount of control over the websites that the account can browse. With a combination of web filtering, web lists, and also activity reporting, you'll be able to find out exactly what's going on with this account on the internet. Now if you'd like to stick with me as I go further in covering all the features of Windows Live Family Safety, make sure to subscribe, and thanks for watching, and like always, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe below.